<laughs> What's coming up next? Hmm. It's Weeknight Update with Allie Mueller and the morning show. That's my favorite. Starting Rebel Wilson at extremely early with Edward Scott. That's all still to come on Nick at Night. Enjoy! Straight from the YouTube dojo. Let's know we're here, so. Easy now. It's week now, they're really new work. And now, man. folks just got a new microphone I just got this uh, camera cleaned up so bear with us here bear with me here this is going to be exciting all right uh, you know who the theme song um, theme song composer and the uh, segment for our maker is you know what shells white winner the shells for like winner all right camera lady and the color being cool let's clap it up for them they're very important to the uh, week now update uh, operation over here You'll see them later on during the World of Randomness. Then you got, and they also do what, their own plays and everything else on their own channels. Nerf of Nine has some gameplays. The Vargas has movie night and a whole bunch of other things related to movies. Uh, for Doku, Satan Ducks and have Interview Land. The Bobby McHenry Show and Bobby McHenry. You know, those channels will be where you'll find uh, similar uh, late night uh, content to this, but, you know, in a little, uh, in a little different way and things like that, you know. And then, of course, you have Bob the Maniac, Dr. Bloods, Heroes, Cassie Dragon, and Sophie Dragon, but uh, all things related to uh, Dragon Tales. All right, I hope that you have enjoyed your uh, Christmas yesterday. And I also hope that, and I also hope that you are ready uh, for the last week of 2022, which we are already in. And... You know, let's get this over with, shall we? What's up? What's up? What's up? What's up with Sophia Carson, a woman who had a big year? Of course, she did say that she wanted to rule the world in 2022. That's right. Now, this past year, she released an album that people have called deeply personal. Wow. She wants Oprah's attention now. She also did Purple Hearts. Yeah, and she called it a challenge. Like she said that it was hard for her to play a character who just had to, um, who she just had to relate to. Really? I told him love to sing. Get a clue. There's not that much, uh, much uh, preparation uh, that will go into that. Not too much preparation. All right. Now, let's see what... Uh, this uh, top eight list uh, has for uh, everybody. Gregors, MP, let's do it. Top eight list, here we go. Thank you. Thank you very much. Nice microphone. Anyway, science category, top eight things that Sophia Carson wants in 2023. Number eight, a big mansion. Number seven, a bigger limo. Number six, sunglasses. Number five, a wedding ring. Number four, a pet. Number three, a horse. Number two, tap dancing shoes. And number one, a late night talk show. Is she trying to take our job? I don't know. Boys, thank you. Hashtag only real for late night. Hashtag spread love around. Hashtag week no update. All right. Please uh, trend those uh, things on social media. And while we're at it, like this thing up. Oh, I say this is not standing up. Like this thing up. Subscribe, ring the bell, share. All that good guys. We can chat up in the comments. The world around us will be coming at you right after this, as well as your talking time. This is week no update. And for all we know, this is your vibe tonight. There she is. Uh, my love, I come for you. Nah, bro, this place has got Wi-Fi. It's so fast. Right?
I'll give you one of these nice new ski caps if you'll just call Empire and order some new carpeting. Oh, you got some other nice things too. You got a free telephone. You get prices from $6.95 installed, including polyfoam padding. You get delivery in 72 hours. And now with your good credit, you get no installment payments until next May. Call us. Our carpeting will warm your feet. Our cap will warm your head. And your call will warm my heart. 588-2300-4. So call right now. Yes, that is Mr. Edward Scott and the boy. Yes, amen. Hey, Ed, did you have a great Christmas yesterday? Yes, I had a great Christmas uh, weekend. How was yours? Uh, it was all right. You know, while uh, fun was had by all, you know, while uh, eggnog, all that good jazz, you know, we had a good time. Oh, that's good. You know, I, you know the things uh, finally begin to uh, warm up because uh, I came in here uh, very quickly. Things ever warm up? Uh, well, ever since uh, the other day, well, temperatures have only uh, gotten up to around, I would say, 19 degrees Fahrenheit, but it uh, feels like uh, 11 degrees. Above or below? Zero. Above zero. Okay, that's pretty good. Pretty good. That means that you're finally starting to get a little bit of the heat. Yeah, of course, it's still winter, so, yeah. Hey, how about the world around us? That's a great idea. All right, people in the control room, pull up the uh, world around us, you folks at home. You know, just sit back and watch, because this is going to be incredible. The world around us. Here we go. All right, well, Christmas is over. And we got a little ways to go before we uh, have to uh, kick uh, 2022 to the curb. So, with that in mind, it's time for another installment of the World Around Us. And now it's time for Pony Adventures, the part of the show where the ponies have an adventure. Pinky! Pinky! Now where is that pony? Um, Spike, have you seen a Pinky? No, I haven't really seen Pinky. Sorry, Twilight. Oh, the reason why I need Pinky is because I'm absolutely working on something for her. But I don't know where she could be. Well, to be completely honest, Twilight, you'll never know where she can be. Might as well you just look for her. What a terrific idea! I'll go look for her. Thanks, Spike. No problem, Twilight. Um, well, I'm not gonna come. I'm just gonna, uh, take a walk. So, um, I'll see you later. Bye-bye. Um, okay. Uh, bye, uh, Spike. I wonder what that was all about. Hmm. All right, time to look for Pinkie Pie. Okay, time to get myself an apple so that I can eat all day. Duh. Huh? Why aren't the apples coming down? Usually I just kick my leg and the apples would fall down. Huh. I wonder why. Ah! Applejack! Maybe she has seen her. Um, hey! Applejack! Huh? Ah! Oh, howdy, Twilight! Boy, am I glad to see you! I'm just having trouble getting this apple down and... Yeah, I just, uh, really do need some help. Hmm. I see, but, um... I can't help right now. 
I uh, am looking for Pinkie Pie. Uh, have you seen her? Oh, I have done gone seen her. She was just here. She just absolutely gave me a nice present. It is so thoughtful for her. And you know, she is on her way to Fluttershy's house. I could take you there if I wanted to. Oh, really? That would be awesome. Thank you, Applejack. No problem, Twilight. That's what best friends are for. Now, come on. We got a pink pony to find. Okay, I'm coming. Ah, sitting here just watching the clouds is so lovely. Ah, that looks like a butterfly. That one looks like a squirrel. And that looks like Twilight and Applejack. Ah, here she is. Uh, Fluttershy. Uh, Fluttershy. Oh, oh, I didn't expect you two to come here, but hi. Uh, but don't scare me like that. Sorry about that, but, um, I'm absolutely looking, um, for, um, Pinkie Pie. Yeah, is she here? Pinkie Pie? Well, actually, yes, she was just here. And, um, she gave me a nice present. It was so thoughtful for her. Now she is on her way to see Rarity. I could take you to her, to her. Well, that's great, because Twilight is looking for her. Yeah, I am looking for her. So, uh, let's get going. Okay, come with me. All right, Twilight, let's go. Okay. Oh, Pinkie Pie, I hope you're there. Oh, man. Pinkie Pie is so thoughtful. Oh, it just makes me sparkle already at this point. <gasps> so nice indeed. Oh, it just makes me sigh all the way through. Ah, there she is. Rarity! Uh, rarity? Um, Rarity? Huh? Oh, my! Don't startle me like that! I did not know that you were coming here! Oh, um, we're sorry that we startled you, but, uh, Twilight is looking for Pinkie Pie. Like, was she just here? Oh, absolutely, Fluttershy. She was just here. She gave me a nice present, which is so thoughtful. She is on her way to see Rainbow Dash. I could totally take you there if I want you to. Oh, that would be great. Thanks, Rarity. Yeah, thanks. No problem, darlings. Now... Follow me. We're right behind you. Yeah, right behind ya. Okay, Pinkie Pie, do not go away now. Oh, yeah. <laughs> I still got it. Now I just need to try that loop-de-loop -loop that Pinkie Pie was talking about. How many times is she supposed to let me do? Oh, six. Right, six times. All right, here goes. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, well, there she is. Rainbow Dash. Rainbow Dash. Rainbow Dash! Rainbow Dash! We need to talk to you! Sig, whoa! My guys! 
Don't do that. I was trying to do the six loop-de-loop, but I failed because you scared me. We're so sorry to startle you, but Twilight is looking for Pinkie Pie. Was she just here? What is up with ponies scaring ponies? It's the strangest thing ever. Yes, she was just here. Now she's heading over to Spike. Spike? But I was with Spike before I got to Applejack, Fluttershy, and Rarity. And before you, Rainbow Dash. Really? Well, that's something you don't hear every day. But she is talking to Spike right now. I could take you to him. Yes, oh yes, take us to Spike, but... What did she give you? Sweet! Oh, the present? <laughs> My, the present that she gave me was doing six loop-de-loops. But I failed because I got my fifth one. All thanks to you guys. But it's okay. Come on, let's go. Hey, wait, we can't go fast as you. Yeah, it's so hard to keep up. Come on, Twilight, let's go. Okay, Pinkie Pie, you better not leave. You better not leave. <laughs> oh, man. They're going to be so surprised of what she has in store. Ah, here they come now. Ah, there he is. Hey, Spike. Hello, Spike. Hi, Spike. Howdy, Spike. Hey, Spike. Nice to see you again. Hey there, everybody. Hello again, Twilight. Well, Twilight is looking for her. So, um, did she, like, left or something? Well, um, let's just say that, um, she is still here at the point. Still here? to give you guys something. Huh? Surprise! <laughs> I have a party just for you! A party? For us? Well, that's so thoughtful! Yeah! Uh-huh, yeah! But why did you do this for us, Pinkie Pie? Well, since you guys are my special friends, I decided to do this just for you. Well then, this is a mighty good party. Thanks, Pinkie Pie. Yeah, thanks. Yeah, this is absolutely marvelous. So good that it makes me feel like to dance. Well then, dance away. Oh, I almost forgot. Pinky, um, I absolutely do need you for something. Oh? And what's that? Is that if you give me a present? Since you've been giving everyone a whole present. Oh, of course, Twilight. And my present is a hug. A hug for Twilight. <laughs> now that was the best present ever. Thanks, Pinkie Pie. Oh, you're welcome, Twilight. Now come on, dance with us. Join the party. Okay. So, Twilight, do you like the surprise? Oh, I sure do, Spike, and wait a minute. Were you the one that was helping Pinkie Pie with the surprise? Yep, 
I may be a little sneaky, but I wanted to do something special to help out. Oh, Spike, you little goofball, come here. <laughs> Thanks, Twilight. <laughs> hey, that tickles. Cut it out. <laughs> This has been Pony Adventures. Until next time to hear Spike say, the sneaky part was the best part. This has been yet another installment of the World of Animals. World of Animus gets its power from casting shoes and Nick at Night. Remember, when late night TV breaks, we fix it. That was fantastic. Wasn't that a great story, folks? <laughs> yeah. Perfect for uh, after Christmas and... Uh, and pretty much New Year's, uh, you know, was story, you know? Oh my goodness. What am I doing now? Is something going on around here? I just, I don't know. Oh, yeah, 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 I know. It's time for a little talking time. Here we go, huh? What time is it? It's talking time. So... Okay, now, listen to this, folks, all right? You know, because we are uh, rapidly approaching the end of the year, you know, I thought that we would talk about uh, celebrities and a few things that would relate to uh, what has happened in 2022. Tonight, we're starting off with uh, what happened to Sophia Carson in 2022. All right, first off, in March of this uh, past year, Sophia Carson released her debut solo album. Well, actually, her uh, debut album. Anyway, it was entitled Sophia Carson. You know, and, and people have called it deeply personal. You know, Sophia Carson said, when I was 11 years old, I was given a song book that I wrote all my songs in. And on the very first page, I wrote, I hope that when people listen to my music, they hear their story in mine. I always knew that with my first album, I wanted to tell a story from start to finish, so I did. I wrote a story about love, about a girl who falls into a beautiful but deceiving love, only to get shattered into pieces. But nonetheless, a story about a girl who survives. That was what uh, Sophia Carson said. And, and she had a bunch of songs, including Still Love You, Fool's Gold, you know, Loud, and the list goes on and on. You know, and I'm glad that Sophia Carson is uh, singing about uh, how uh, she feels, and I'm glad that she's also trying to relate to her experiences, you know, to other people, or trying to get other people to relate to uh, her story. Of course, only problem is <laughs> not too many people have gone through what uh, she went through, and she hasn't gone through what too many people have gone through. So it's hard to really relate and it's hard to really correlate uh, everything uh, to one another. You know, if you catch my drift. If you catch my drift, comment down below. And even if you don't, please still uh, comment down below. All right? But whatever. To each his or her own at this point. To each his or her own, okay? Now, Let's move on to this past summer, which is uh, something that uh, people uh, have been talking about more often when they uh, talk about Sophia Carson. That's right. She made uh, the biggest uh, project uh, come to life. That's right. We're talking about Purple Hearts on uh, Netflix. Now, now Sophia Carson has made it quite clear that she's very happy about how you know, like he wanted to, you know, like do uh, something that relates to storytelling and everything else. And 
and she was very happy about doing the Purple Hearts, but she also called Purple Hearts a real challenge. You know what? Uh, the greatest, um, her greatest challenge, as a matter of fact. Now she said she had to do a lot of research into every aspect that could have shaped and formed the woman that uh, Cassie, her character, was when everybody met her. And wow. How can I uh, really uh, put it all into words, okay? <coughs> Excuse me. You know what? Uh, she said that uh, she had uh, type 1 diabetes. She, uh, she talked about her uh, worldview and, uh, and her stance on marriage and uh, things like that. But if you think about it for a moment, if you really think about it, then uh, you could tell that. You know, he just described a lot of differences between Sophia and Cassie. However, the main uh, similarity that, that the two of them uh, share is the fact that they both share the love for music. Actually, there's another one, of course, and that one is, of course, the fact that they uh, both wanted to uh, find love. Hey! You know, and all I gotta say is, Sophia, you have had quite the successful year, and and if Netflix keeps uh, knocking on your door, you know, with more opportunities, then uh, I think that you're uh, bound to have. An even, uh, an even more successful year in 2023. Of course, this is just my opinion, and, and I know that Sophia's probably not watching this, so I don't know. I really don't know, man. I mean, I really don't know, kid. I, well, to wrap up uh, 2022, we got a whole uh, great week. We got a great week of shows coming at you. Just finished this one. Tomorrow, we're going to talk about Ryan Seacrest. Then on Wednesday, Elizabeth Gillies. Oh, we're going to talk about the how uh, she managed to get herself unemployed this past year. Thursday, Jamie Foxx. Then on Friday will be our uh, salute to uh, 2022. That's right. Actually, it will be our roast uh, to uh, 2022. That's right. We are going to uh, really let uh, 2022 uh, have it. And we're going to have a bunch of surprises. You know that the color being cool and the camera are going to be around uh, all this week. You know that Mild Chakra and Bling are going to come by on uh, Friday. And you know that uh, great things are going to happen. All right, so better not miss it because this is going to be a whole lot of fun. Until tomorrow, this is Ellie Cogging Mueller saying, guess what, folks? At the news, I am out skis. Farewell. TV pleasure at your command. Hello out there from TV.